tell you, next time you would not put your mouth in the matters that does not concern you. So get out of my office! I'm sorry, ma. She said you should get out. I'm sure a lot of you have heard that I'll be away for two weeks. I have a conference meeting outside the country. Now, I want you all to be of your best behavior. HR? Yes, sir. Please, I want you to oversee everything that's happening in the office. And please, employ only the qualified candidates. Of course, sir. Accountant. Yes, sir. Please, no unnecessary fund should be leaving the company's account. Okay, sir. Logistics. Yes, sir. The figures should balance. Definitely, sir. You all are the head of your department, and I expect the best from you. One more thing, Anya will become the head of the cleaning department. And lastly, like I said, please, you all should take care of the office affairs. Joe? Yes, sir. Let's take our leave. Okay, sir. Safe trip, sir. Thank you. Please do a great job. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye, sir. Congratulations. Thank you. Wow, he's gone. <gasps> Finally. Finally. Ah, I can breathe. I've been waiting for this for weeks. Weeks, bro. My car we arrived this month. <laughs> Money on my mind. God. I'm sorry. But we're not supposed to be having this kind of noise in this environment. What is wrong with you? Because they made you head of peasants, you think you can talk to us executives. Didn't they just hire you a week ago? Where do you get these balls from? When did all this nonsense start? So because the boss just promoted you and made you the head of cleaners. Look, I have my eyes on you. Better don't cross me in this office. Leave her, I know how to handle her. I'm sorry, I'm only trying to. Now shut up and get the hell out of my office. Just get out. Well, you never said the meeting was over. Well, it's over for you. Like, Leave! Your life is being ah. you by the not you. Get out of here! Head of cleaners. Can you imagine? Just ah, go. Just what go. audacity. Because they made her head of cleaners. Yeah, He's talking to us. Executives. Like Don't mind that, Jerry. Enough of that and go to eh? How about that? Um... Anne, please come to my office. So, this is what we'll do. I've sent it to your email. We are going to write $7,000. But we both know. Okay. Thank you. But we both know it is $4,500. Yes. But don't worry, I'll give you $500. $500. Make it $1,000. Okay. And this one, that is $11,000. Okay. You would write $11,350. It's on your system. Check your email. Okay. Are you seeing it? Yes, I can see it too. Okay. Because we can't just be here and not gain anything. At the end of the month, we have something to take home. I like that. <laughs> Excuse me, ma. Excuse me, sir. Sorry to interrupt. I overheard you inflating price and taking cuts for yourself. Ma, I feel this is really wrong. Are you talking to me? Yes, ma. There was a price of 11000 But you decided to change it to 14000 This is really wrong, ma. <laughs> oh, oh, wow, really? Um, This water is hot. Why is it hot like this? Sorry, ma. The water is not hot. Really? Oh, come and check it yourself. Come. How dare you? Next time, you would not put your mouth in the matters that does not concern you. So get out of my office! I'm sorry, ma. She said you should get out. Can you imagine? An ordinary cleaner. Where did she get the audacity from? Just leave her. I know what to do. So this one that is 14,500 will write 20,000. Yes, no problem. Good afternoon, sir. Yes, good afternoon. I'll have your seat. Okay, thank you, sir. <sighs> sir, I've been expecting my pregnancy leave later. And I've not received it. I feel like there's a mix-up somewhere. Um, how long are you? 
um, I'll be eight and a half by the end of this month. In fact, I shouldn't be coming to work anymore. You know, the baby can come in anytime soon. Okay, let's do this. Come back to me when you're nine months pregnant. Sir! You don't understand what I just said. I said come back when you're nine months. All right, let me be generous. Come back a day before you're nine months, then I'll give you the leave. But sir, I need to buy baby clothes. I need to buy an outer care. Stop, 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 stop. You can send someone to do all this. There's no one to send. My, my husband goes to work every day. I have the family around. Madam, why didn't you and your husband plan this earlier? Don't come here and put pressure on the company. All right? But, but sir, please, I, I know but this. But nothing. This is why I don't like employing women. You people like stressing. I'm pretty sure you want to go home and play around. Am I the one that impregnated you? Please, leave. Sir, if you know please. you cannot take it, leave. You can quit. No, no, it's not up to that. Sir. Leave my office. If you do not like it, you can quit. Leave my office. Please, sir. Leave! Good afternoon, Mrs. Mary. Good afternoon. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Is there anything a problem? Don't worry. There's nothing you can do about it, so just let it go. Mrs. Mary, I know I'm just the head of cleaner. My department is like the lowest tier. But Mrs. Mary, I am the head of the department and it counts for something. You can talk to me. What is the problem? I'm trying to get my pregnancy leave and he said I should come back when I'm nine months. No, you should have gotten that since when you were seven months. You know what? Don't let this bother you, okay? I'll talk to the HR. Thank you. Okay. okay. I'll see you later. I'm sorry, sir. Sorry to intrude. What do you want? Okay, sir. Sir, I know I'm not the HR. I'm just a cleaner here. But, sir, I just met Miss Rose. She told me she didn't get her leave. And she's almost due. And who are you to solicit for her? Sir, as a fellow staff, I believe we have rights. And our rights should be protected. You have rights. Should I use my rights as the HR? Or is it because the boss made me hire you directly, you think you have wings? Even if for that, I would have fired you. Come on, leave my office now! I'm sorry, sir. Sorry for yourself. Get out! Good day, everyone. Good day. Well, um... It's no longer news that our boss is not around and the court saying you'll be spending an extra week. So I'll be taking the meeting for the day. <laughs> well, we all know it's our bi-weekly meeting today. So we're going to figure everything out today. Miss Accountant. Yes, sir. I must commend you. In fact, you are doing a great job. I saw what you sent. Please, can we give her a round of applause? And uh, Mr. Logistics, right. please can we give him a round of applause? <laughs> I got you, I got you. Did you send those things to my mom? Yeah, of course, I, I sent them. I sent okay, them. how about the one I asked you to send to everybody? Yeah, I gave to everybody. Although I did not send to the head of the cleaning department. Oh, she doesn't deserve it. And also, uh, Mr. James and Mrs. Johnson, they said they don't want, so they refused it. Well, it's not everybody that is meant to enjoy. I said the same thing. Good, 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 good. Moving forward, how about um, the TCLP contract? Uh, well, I already have the budget for that. And also, uh, I did the common thing, you know. Wow, <laughs> so wow, to this wow. Time, you guys should get it. Wow, that's great. Excuse me, sir. Please, I don't think taking the company's personal possessions to your homes is right. 
again with the interruption. You shouldn't talk in this meeting. Cleaner, you only talk when I ask you to. What is your problem? Who asked for your opinion? Fine. I think I have enough evidence now. Evidence of what? What? Evidence? Evidence. Hello, sir. Yes, sir. I have everything on tape now. I'm also a witness. You can come in now, sir. Well, a piece of information for you guys. I'm not actually a cleaner. Then what are you? I will let the boss explain that to you. Boss? Yes, I will explain it. Uh, welcome, sir. Welcome, sir. Welcome, welcome, sir. sir. You are welcome, sir. Uh, how, how was the conference? How was your trip, sir? Welcome, sir. How was the flight, sir? It's good to see you, sir. You look good, sir. Anne here is not a cleaner. Anne is an actor. I employed Anne to uncover all your secret activities. My assistant. My HR. My accountant. And my logistics. I am disappointed in every one of you. <sighs> you know what? Go to your office. Clear your desk and leave. Please, please, please. You all are fired. Please, sir. Please. Please. She lied. She lied to you. Please. Sir. On. Please sit. Thank you, sir. 